The news has been filled with Meta, Google, Amazon, Microsoft, Job Cuts, all the bellwether tech companies who for the last two decades have always been up and to the right are heading downward. Understandably, this has created a lot of fear and trepidation as this fills the headlines. But looking beyond the news cycles, doom and gloom, what is the reality behind the market right now? Of course, I'm no Nostradamus, not even Joe Stradamus, but my read is that if you look at those tech companies themselves, they only make up 2% of the entire U.S. employment population. What's more, during the pandemic, cash was cheap, demand was really high, and investors pushed these companies to go for broke. And they took some big bets to go fast and get as much of the share as they possibly could get. And as a result, these companies grew by 50% in one year. Amazon hiring alone was absolutely astronomical. And even after these layoffs, all of these companies are still bigger than they were before the pandemic ever began. Couple that with the fact that the actual employment rate has grown 60% quarter over quarter, plus we still have a negative US unemployment rate and one of the highest saving rate in years. Assuredly, we will not see frothiness we saw in 2021. Hey, and if the Fed continues to hit the brakes, we could have a hard landing late in 2023. But for now, I see a return to some normalcy. With certain sectors like digital health and chronic disease growing and still hiring, and some failing a little bit, like capital equipment and the big iron imaging companies. You know what? And certain companies are winning, and some are losing. It may not be the double digits that we've seen, but we're gonna see a more normal, steady pace at the beginning of 2023, through the fall. And then after that, I'll look into my crystal ball for our market in the future. Until then, give us a call if we can help you improve lives by uniting great people with great companies. Thank you.